personally like to wish you and your family the, the best and happy of all holidays. Merry Christmas, Bubby. I'm going to turn it over now to my number one driver, Mr. Ed Carpenter. It was the weekend before Christmas, and new IndyCar team owner Ed Carpenter, who also drives for his new team, was promoting his sponsor, Fuzzy's Vodka, at Benny's Beverage Depot in Willowbrook, Illinois. Uh, you know, it's been a lot of fun. You know, we were fortunate enough to get involved with, with Fuzzy and Fuzzy's Vodka back in 2010, and uh, it's a relationship that's grown. They were on my helmet last year when I was racing for Sarah and Dollar General. Tried to get them on the car, but just didn't work out with the, the Dollar General thing. Um, and then as, as we move towards this next season, you know, just had a great opportunity with, with backing from Fuzzy's Vodka to, to go out on a limb and, and start our own team. And it's been an exciting venture so far. Well, you, my partner you. is ecstatic about uh, the auto racing. He's always been a, an IndyCar fan, uh, which is tremendous. Because, I mean, I've always respected what these guys do for a living, even though I do think they're just a little bit crazy. You know, chasing a golf ball, golf ball might not be the the sweetest little sport in the world, but it's non-contact. These guys are doing things at 200 and some odd miles an hour that just blows my mind. It really does. Carpenter drove for Sarah Fisher's team last season and won his first race at Kentucky. By season's end, he decided to go it on his own and formed his own team. Yeah, it's it's been very busy. You know, I'm definitely waking up a little earlier than normal these days, but uh, it's going well. We hired Derek Walker to, to be a GM for the team, and. He's doing a fine job, and uh, the team the team's really building out. So, you know, we're nearing the holidays, and everything slows down a little bit, but, you know, I'm happy with where we are. Obviously, a lot, a lot of work to do leading up to the first race in St. Pete in the end of March, but uh, confident that we'll be ready and prepared. Carpenter's new team really gets down to work next week as it takes delivery of its new 2012 IndyCar. For RPMTonight.com, I'm John Kernan.